Now let's talk about view range. View range is something you can set up in any of the plans, the floor plans, the ceiling plans, or any other plans that you may have. For instance, you can see it in the properties area under extents and view range. Here we have several options for the floor plan. For the floor plan, you can have a top or associated level, which you can select from, a cut plane, a bottom, and a view depth. And on the right side, you can create an offset. The way it can be explained is if you press on the show, Revit tries to explain what that means. However, that is not always clear. Uh, and the better way that I can inform you of what those are is by looking at the following picture. The plan view has a top, which means that anything that's modeled above it is not going to be seen in that floor plan specifically. Not to say that it doesn't exist, it just is not going to be visible. The cut plane is everything that you're cutting through that is going to appear in very thick lines. For instance, if you're cutting uh, through a round column, all that you will see is the very thick outline of that column in the middle. In between the bottom and the top is going to be you, uh, visible and very good outlines and pretty medium sized lines, unlike the cut plane. Cut plane will be thicker than anything else between the top and the bottom line. The view depth, on the other hand, is going to show items that are shown below and they will be shown in the lighter line weight automatically. The same rule applies for the ceiling plan. So to demonstrate this, for instance, I want to model a few walls. And I want to make sure that I set the base constraint of the walls to be from level 2 to level 3. If you would like to see it from the 3D point, you can see this is my level 1, level 2, 3, 4, and 5. From the east, you can see that my walls are modeled between level 2 and level 3. In order for us to see anything above uh, our first floor, we have to make sure that our cut plane is going to be over in this area. For instance, let's go to first floor, view range. Let's set our top to be 23 feet, for instance, and our cut plane to be anything above 22 feet, such as 22 feet and 6 inches. So we're cutting through our wall at 22 feet and 6 inch outline right here. If we go, however, to our level 2, we'll auto automatically see the outline because we're cutting through the uh, 4 feet above our level 2. So that we're cutting essentially 26 feet right here somewhere. 